Hi, welcome, Simon here, and hope you're doing well. In this video, I'll walk you through step by step on how to try to troubleshoot symptoms that have no display on your desktop. So for example, you turn on the computer, the computer stays on, you can hear the fan is running, but you have no display on your monitor screen. You wonder what is going on? Is it my monitor went bad, or is it a computer graphics card has gone bad, or what might be the issue? So in this video, we're going to troubleshoot the graphics card and we're going to remove the graphics card and use the onboard motherboard graphics and hopefully there would be a display on your monitor screen. Alright, so let me show you the front of the desktop and this is the Dell XPX and this is 8950 and it does have a graphics card here in the back. So if you take a look at the back of my computer here, you can see that this additional slot on this is where the graphics cable gonna connect to your monitor okay so the computer does have a graphics here which is the display port uh, you can try to see if there's any display coming off the port here which is the onboard built-in graphics or maybe we need to replace the graphics card right one or the other and let's go ahead and start to troubleshoot it so um, the computer is on the side and here you can see the little lash and this is the opener but you need to get yourself a flat head screwdriver and go ahead and unscrew that screw the screw does not come off the screw is going to stay in just like that uh, you just have to unscrew it now the next step is to pull that lash open and lift the side panel straight up so lift it up towards your body and you just remove it okay so this computer here does come with a graphics card maybe the graphics card has gone bad who knows the computer stays on but no display right so we're going to remove this and then try to do direct connection to the motherboard so the next step is to go ahead and open up that little lash and this is the uh, the box that is holding on to the graphics card so let's go ahead and disconnect the power cable this is the 8 pin power cable you can just go ahead and put it on the side disconnect that now the next step is to you see this little blue clipper so push it up and slide that thing off okay so you need to push that little clipper the safety pin and slide it straight up once you have removed that now the graphics card is ready to be removed you see this little clipper right there it's very all the way underneath right on that one right there it's a PCIe little clipper what you want to do is you want to push it down you need to open it and at the same time lift up the graphics card just lift it straight up and that's how you remove it so this this is the clipper I'm referring to the clipper need, needs to be pressed down okay all right so once you press down lift it up you will just remove the graphics card now for those of you that wants to upgrade the graphics card to a better gaming system that's how you do it replace the graphics card now what you can do is you want to put the side panel back together quickly enough and then go ahead and plug it into this port right here this is a display port if you connect to the monitor and you get a display then more likely your graphics card has just gone bad okay there's another way you can troubleshoot is to try to reset the ram or change out the ram sometimes the ram may be the cause of it that has no display on your monitor screen all right so i hope this video is helpful if you do find the video helpful please smash the like button click the uh, subscribe button if you haven't subscribed uh, thanks for liking the video and comment below let me know how did you do all right thanks for watching until next time bye now